Sassy, thank you so much for coming up here and to share your incredible uh, testimony. Can you tell us what you were struggling with and just your journey of receiving your healing and where you are now? Yes. So I had gastritis for like 10 years when I was in high school. And so like it started very little, like it was painful, but not that bad. So um, every time we'll get, you know, like years pass and I will get it like once a year only, like for the week probably, and it'll go away. So, but then it got worse. With the years, it got worse. So to the, to the point that I had to um, throw up because of the pain, and that would help. I would throw up, and the pain would go away. So I did that, I think, like for, like I said, like 10 years. But um, then I went to the doctor. They did some tests on me. They didn't find anything. They gave me some kind of pills. It never helped. So uh, I couldn't eat, like, when I used to eat, like, stuff that was too oily, that's when the pain would come. But, you know, Hispanic people, that's what we like to eat, you know? <laughs> Fried, fried food. So, uh, so the pain was very painful. So I went a couple times to the doctor, to the emergency, and they didn't do anything to me. So I remember when we were here, when we just moved here, uh, Pastor Vladimir had a, a prayer for the last month of, I think it was Christmas time. So he said that, you know, to leave everything bad behind this year, like everything that is like bothering you, any sickness, addiction and stuff, so to write any paper. So I was like, gastritis, you know? So for me, it was new to, you know, ask something like by faith, like, okay, it's gonna be gone, you know? So I was like, okay, why not, you know? So I wrote it down, I put gastritis. So I prayed for it and I was like, I know I'm gonna be healed. So um, I wait for a little bit, then I'm like, I'm gonna drink this, um, this chocolate that we have, Abuelita, because that one is, that is very oily. <laughs> so I'm like, and every time I will drink it, I will get the pain. So I'm like, if this time I drink and, and the pain doesn't come, that means I'm healed. So I did that, I drank a cup of that chocolate, and I didn't have any pain. So that was like after 10 years with that, you know, suffering for that pain. And since that time, I never had that pain again. And that's like, I think already maybe, I would say six, six years, I think. Wow. Yeah. wow, six years, come on. That's incredible. Tati, I, I like what you said, and I want you just to maybe uh, share your word of advice for that the faith, you coming to church, it was new for you. It was something that, you know, you didn't grow up with, but what would be your encouragement if that is something that people are listening on live stream right now or here for their first time or a couple of times, and they're like, this is all new to me. Can I receive the healing since I'm new to this faith? What would be your words of encouragement for that? Uh, even if you don't believe it, trust God, because that was me. I was like, I don't know if it's going to work, but why not, you know? So I was like, sure, I know God's going to heal me. You know, just trust him. Even if you don't believe in that moment, trust him. You'll see. Because that was me and I got healed. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Amen. Thank you so much, Tati. Thank you for watching this content. I know this was a blessing to you. We would like to ask you to subscribe to our channel and click on the bell on our channel so that each time we upload something, you can be notified. Don't forget to share this content with your friends and family and on social media. We're so thankful to you. Better is not good enough. The best is yet to come.